Welcome on board. During the next few days, we'll be committed to offering you our services so your stay on board will be pleasant, but most of all, safe. Therefore, we want to ask you to keep in mind the following information and recommendations. Safety Recommendations The boat will be in constant movement, so we ask that you walk carefully on deck, holding onto the handrails and guardrails. Do not run because the floor may be slippery. Embarking and Debarking A motorized Zodiac is used to raise and lower the boat. Before boarding the Zodiac, put on the life jacket you'll be given in the debarking area. A crew member will help you transfer. Offer him your arm and hold onto the crew member's arm firmly. Emergency For emergencies, the boat is equipped with GPS, radar, long-distance communication, flares, and other instruments. It has one emergency life rafts that have enough space for all the passengers on board. An equipment piece entitled EPIRB or Emergency Position Indicating Radio Beacon is on board. In case of emergency, the radio sends a satellite signal with the location of the boat to all rescue operatives, national and international dispatches. In case of emergency, an alarm will sound. If you're in your cabin, take your emergency life jacket and go immediately to the meeting place. Open and put on the life jacket, inserting the arm and the head. Pass the straps across your back and pass the other strap from back to the front through your legs. Tighten and adjust. This life jacket has a light that will turn on when it comes into contact with the water. It also has reflective tape and a whistle. If the alarm sounds and you are not in your cabin, go directly to the meeting place where you will be given another life jacket. Take your passport, shoes and a jacket with you only if you can do so quickly. Fire The boat has smoke detectors. If you smoke, do so in open areas and never inside. If you detect smoke on board, shout fire and move away so crew member can take over. Man overboard If you see that a person has accidentally fallen into the water, shout loudly, man overboard. Look for one of the life buoys available on deck and throw it as close to the person as you can. Do not lose sight of that person. Snorkel a member of the crew will deliver the equipment for snorkeling at the beginning of the cruise. The mask and fins you receive should be stored in the bag that coordinates to the number of your cabin, so you can use the same set until the end of the cruise. You'll also receive wetsuits to snorkel, yellow for women and black for men. Once you find your size wetsuit, remember the number that's written on the collar so you can use the same suit during the entire cruise and avoid confusion with other guests' equipment. For your safety, during snorkeling, stay close to your group for the duration and follow all of the instructions from your guide. Cabins All the cabins have individual air conditioning units, so you can regulate the temperature with the remote in your cabin. Follow the instructions located next to the panel or ask for help to a crew member. When flushing the toilet, Press down on the main button located next to it and then let up on the button once the toilet has emptied. Stay informed with the instructions located next to the panel. In order to avoid damage to the pipes, please discard paper and other objects in the wastebasket, not in the toilet. To take a shower, open the faucet to the left side for hot water or right side for cold water. To use the hand shower, press or pull the lever located on the pipe. All the bathrooms have shampoo and soap dispensers. These products are biodegradable and environmentally friendly. Please do not use products that are not biodegradable. You'll find a small hand towel, a large bath towel, and another large towel with the number of your cabin on it, which you can take to the beach or use for snorkeling. In your cabin, you will find a safety box. To use it, please follow the instructions located next to the box. If you have doubts, please ask for help to a crew member. Tap water is not potable. We suggest that you use water from the dispenser for drinking or brushing your teeth. You can refill your personal bottle as many times as you want. Sailing Part of the experience on board is sailing when conditions are right. During this activity, we ask you to be careful with the cables and the sailing infrastructure because they're apt to move abruptly or unexpectedly. We invite you to relax in the jacuzzi. Just tell a crew member ahead of time if you want to use it. 
but remember that the jacuzzi cannot be filled or used while the ship is sailing. Park Rules The National Park has rules you must respect in order to help preserve the natural wealth of the Galapagos Islands. You must always be accompanied by a naturalist guide in the visiting sites. Hire only authorized tourist services. Stay on the paths and obey the signs. Maintain a distance of 2 meters between you and the animals. Do not feed the animals. Do not use flash or artificial light to take photos or videos. The National Park permits camping only in specific marked areas. Do not bring vegetable or other animal organisms from outside to the islands. Do not buy souvenirs made of vegetable or animal material. Do not write on rocks or trees. Do not throw trash on the ground in visiting areas. Smoking or making campfires in visiting areas is prohibited. Fishing is prohibited. Submarines, motorized water sports, and air tourism are not permitted. Thank you for your attention. Following these recommendations will make your stay more pleasant in the marvelous Galapagos Islands. Welcome.